Welcome to another episode of Essential SQL Minute. Today, let's learn how to retrieve the top or bottom of our result set. Here on the screen, you can see that I have a result set that is, or a query that's going to pull back every salesperson from the vSalesPern table. When I execute it, it brings back 17 rows. But let's suppose I want to see the highest performing salespeople. In fact, I want to see those top 10 salespeople by sales for last year. Well, to do that, what I can do is use what's called the top clause. And here I will show you the query. So it's select top 10 and then the columns, first name, last name, and so on from sales um, person. Now the trick here is, is that I'm ordering the result by sales last year in descending order. So that means the sales are going to go from like, you know, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, as opposed to ascending order, which would be 0, 1, 2, 3. So when I run this, you'll see now that we have the top performing salesperson as our first result on down, and there's a total of 10. Now, conversely, I could also get the poorest performing salespeople, and to do so, I would run pretty much the same exact query, top 10, but now the trick is, is I'm going to do it in ascending order. So the sales are going to go from 0 to 1 to 2 to 3, and we're going to get the top 10 in that order. And as I see, I execute that, you'll see that we get some salespeople that had no sales last year, and then the sales slowly go up. Now, I could also get these same people sorted by their last name, and to do that, it's slightly trickier. Uh, I need to use what's called a common table expression, so let me introduce that. And here you'll see that we have the same query, the select top 10 in ascending order, but this is wrapped into what's called a common table expression, which is a way of providing a result within a query. So this common table expression, CT salesperson, is going to return the first name, last name, and sales last year from this query. And in fact, the only rows in CTE salesperson are going to be those 10 rows, these top 10 rows, which just happen to be the lowest performing salespeople. But when I do select from this table, the cool thing is now is I can order by last name since I'm only working with those 10. So when I run this query, what you're going to see is, let me get the result here, that is now bringing in those lowest performing salespeople, but it's now ordered by their last name. 